My husband thinks I was rude to his friends because I rejected their advances to swing with them. My husband thinks I was rude to his friends over the weekend, but I just felt I was being honest, and they were being inappropriate. My husband and I have been married for 13 years now. We are both in our early 40s and have two wonderful preteen kids. We were college sweethearts, and he is the only person I have been with. We have a lovely life. Last week, one of my husband's childhood friend John and his wife Leah visited us along with their kids. I have known them for a long time, and they visit us every summer, and we take vacations together. Our kids are of same age and get along well. On Saturday night, after the kids went to bed, Leah and John suggested we go to her hot tub and get drunk. I only drink socially and I was just sipping some wine, while others were seriously getting wasted. Leah brought up the issue of intercourse and how they had slowed down a lot when the kids were young, and now again rediscovered their spark as the kids were getting older. John told us that they have also been experimenting with swinger lifestyle and how amazing their experience has been. My husband was drunk and told them that we never lost the spark, and things have been great, while I was just uncomfortably listening to them. Leah asked up if we have ever tried swinging, or open relationship, since we both got into a relationship when we were young. My husband had girlfriends before we met me, but I have never been with another man. Leah asked me if I have ever wondered if I missed out on that phase. I told her that I did not since it was like winning a lottery with my husband and it would be foolish to regret not buying the wrong tickets. John asked my husband if he has ever thought about swinging or being with someone else. John was telling him about how the experience is amazing and just adds spice to a marriage. My husband was being polite and listening to it intently, and asking him questions about how they got into it, how they meet other couples, jealousy issues, etc. Leah finally asked me if I would consider something like swinging and it just made me very uncomfortable. I wanted to shut down the discussion and told her that I can never imagine another man touching me in that way, and probably would leave my husband if he ever thinks of doing the same. She asked why and I told her that another man touching me would feel like cheating to me even if my husband was okay with it, and his love is enough for me that I do not seek attention from other men. That shut Leah up and John changed the subject quickly and we carried on. We did not talk about this for the rest of the trip. After they left, my husband thought that I was being judgmental towards Leah and John about their lifestyle. He feels I should have been nicer to them, and not equated swinging to cheating or implied that Leah was seeking attention from other men. I stood my ground and told him that I felt uncomfortable with them pushing their lifestyle onto us. Was I being rude to Leah regarding their swinger lifestyle? I feel everyone should mind their own damn business, but I was triggered by John essentially telling my husband to think about sleeping with other women, and Leah implying that I should somehow be less satisfied because I did not sleep around with a lot of guys. Moreover, I also felt my husband should have shut off the subject immediately instead of asking for more information and stories from John. Now for the comments. Commenter implied that Leah was seeking attention from other men that was wrong but it just seemed like poor phrasing and at least it finally shut the conversation down because they were trying to coerce you guys into trying their lifestyle and that's a gross overstep of boundaries. Moreover, I also felt my husband should have shut off the subject immediately instead of asking for more information and stories from John. You need to get to the bottom of this because he sounded way too invested to me as well but his questions did cover some of the general curiosities that I've seen so try not to take it to deeply original poster let me clarify about what my husband was asking about. He was asking about where they meet these couples some apps them mentioned and private parties they attend. It made me really uncomfortable how curious my husband was about the whole situation. Comment or not the idiot they were on a fishing expedition in your hot tub. I bet John and Leah had previously chatted about seducing you too and this was phase 1 original poster to be clear, they never asked us anything inappropriate. However, I felt they were trying to convince us how exciting their new life is. It rubbed me the wrong way that Leah made comments about my personal life and questioned if I was unhappy that I did not date anyone except my husband. Based on all the responses, I need to have a serious conversation with my husband why he thought I was rude and shutting them down bluntly. Update 1 Thank you for all the replies they really helped me gain a lot of different perspectives. I talked to my husband last night, and I cannot believe how much worse things have gotten. I can't believe so many of you could see what I completely overlooked. After the kids went to sleep, I spoke with my husband, Mike. I told him that the situation from the weekend was still bothering me, and I wanted to discuss it. I asked him why he didn't feel angry at Leah for implying that I should feel bad for not sleeping with more men, and why that thought didn't repulse him. He responded that just because we don't agree with someone's lifestyle choices doesn't mean we should look down on their actions. He said that while I was right to shut her down, equating it to cheating or attention seeking isn't fair to them. He added that I don't know the circumstances that led them to start swinging in the first place, 
and we shouldn't judge them. I pushed further, and he told me that Leah and John weren't doing well last year, and that John felt Leah was distancing herself. Leah brought up the idea of an open relationship with John, which he initially disagreed with. However, they decided that splitting up wouldn't be good for them financially and would be worse for the kids. John then proposed the idea of swinging so they could go out together and avoid doing anything behind each other's backs. According to Mike, they both seem to have reconnected since then, and John said Leah has been happier and more present in their relationship. Mike also mentioned that Leah was just curious about me because I've never even kissed another man. He admitted he was upset because I rudely shut them down, and he feels John might be hurt because Mike believes John was forced into this lifestyle and because I acquainted Leah's suggestion to cheating. This got me thinking, so I asked Mike how he knew all of this. He told me that John had been confiding in him about it since last year, but he never told me because it was John and Leah's secret to share, and he didn't know if they were comfortable telling me. I started replaying the events of that night in my head. After the kids went to bed, John, Leah, and Mike were drinking. Mike was trying to get me to try his vodka drink, but I'm a lightweight, and I know my limits, so I stuck to sipping some wine. Leah decided the weather was great, and we all stepped outside onto the patio. Mike started the hot tub, and Leah and John decided to get in, wearing only their underwear. Mike did the same. They all were asking me to do the same, but I kept my t-shirt on. I didn't think much of it since I've seen both of them in swimwear before. That's when they told me they were into swinging. John and Mike were discussing the benefits of swinging, and John was telling Mike how amazing it has been. Meanwhile, Leah was trying to convince me that I should be more curious about sleeping with other men. I think a lot of you are right they might have been trying to recruit us. What makes it worse is that my husband knew about them and still tried to get me drunk and asked me to undress before getting into the tub. I asked him if he thought they were trying to get us to swing with them. He smiled and said no, but I can easily tell when my husband isn't being truthful, so I kept digging. He then admitted that Leah had asked him about it when they were planning the trip, and he laughed it off because he thought it was a joke. At this point, I was beyond pissed. Leah openly asked my husband about sleeping with him, and he never told me about it. I was playing the perfect host all weekend to a woman who I seriously doubt it was a joke asked my husband if he wanted to sleep with her. I was so furious that I slept on the sofa. Mike kept apologizing, saying he didn't want to out Leah and John to me because he thought it was private. However, I genuinely feel Mike's actions were also inappropriate he tried to get me undressed and drunk in front of these people. I don't know what to do. I think it's safe to say that I'm never going to be around Leah and John again. However, I feel more hurt by Mike and his actions and am unsure of what I'll do next. Now for the comments. Commenter your husband was trying to get you drunk so he can sleep with Leah, and possibly pimp you out without your consent. I would not feel safe with him at all. The fact he never told you beforehand while trying to get you to engage in their behavior is disturbing. Original poster that is exactly how I am feeling. He keeps on telling me that he would never think of Leah and John in that way, and I am overreacting. He also says that he is not interested in that lifestyle and I am assuming the worst case scenario and he was just trying to protect his friend's privacy. He also told me that he did not think John and Leah would tell me about them being swingers in the hot tub and they just got drunk and carried away. Commenter I don't believe your husband. Too many things line up with he was interested in seeing where this would go. The pressure to drink, the pressure to undress, encouraging his friend to keep talking selling you on the idea they absolutely brought this up to recruit you both, the wife asking your husband to sleep together before you all got together is the nail in the coffin. To tell you to apologize is crazy. He is interested but they were asking you questions first to feel you out. I can guarantee he told his friends he was curious and encouraged them to tell you more to see your reaction in a safe way because he knew bringing it up would show he wanted it. Honestly I would call the other husband and say I would like the truth, my husband told me you have shared that you both are swinging and then he told me your wife called and asked about hooking up before your visit. To me it feels like my husband was part of the plan to get me to join in that evening. I would like you to be honest with me if he is dying inside he might actually tell you the truth. Original poster thanks for the suggestion. I am going to call John tonight to get more info. I am wondering if Leah told John what she told Mike because Mike specifically told me Leah not John jokingly asked him about it. 